So fortunately for me, recently my neighbour came round and gave me this TA02 chassis. Now Christian knows that I'm into RCs, he's seen me running them outside and he thought I might like it, which I thought was pretty decent of him. Now my initial reaction was to do it up and try and get it back to how it was, but after looking it over it really needs more money than I'm willing to spend. So I've decided that I'm going to keep it for spares and that happens to be extremely lucky considering I just stripped my pre-runner's spur gear. The reason why the spur gear was stripped was before I took the pre-runner out I put on a new year racing metal motor mount and when I put the motor onto the mount I didn't realise it actually leaves the pinion slightly off centre. So there's a large gap one side and a small gap the other side. So when I put the motor and mount back into the truck, I'd obviously put it on the wrong way round, causing the pinion to be hard up against the spur gear, causing it to strip within about a minute of running. So there's a lesson learnt by me, and hopefully somebody else watching this video too. I took the spur gear out of the old TA02 chassis. I've taken all the gears out of my pre-runner chassis, cleaned them up the best I could, re-greased them and put them back in along with the replacement spur gear. I haven't had the chance to take it out for a run yet because the weather has been absolutely diabolical here on the south coast of England the last few days. So as soon as we get a break in the weather and I get some time I will make another video of it and hopefully it will last longer than the one at the beginning of this video.